I mean, everyone, coach among other people, were extremely excited about making NFTs uh, last year. And we asked ourselves, you know, like, how do we do this in a way that's authentic to our brand? And our approach, I think, was pretty interesting. We decided we were going to take items from the archive, partner with MyCap, scan them in, and that way we could take something that was not accessible to the general public. You know, no, you can't really buy a, in the objects in the coach archive, but by scanning them in and uh, making them NFTs, we're able to share that. Absolutely. And what you see is an actual physical product. When you add an environment to it, what does it do? It brings it life. It makes you actually have a kind of an emotional connection. After you have that, your consumer is captured, you know, and when you have your consumer captured, they're going to always, always, always be there coming back and forth. So do you want to kind of show them what happened yeah, after that? Yeah, I think our learning from this was, so we had a neat idea, right? Take, a, take an archival item, scan it in, make it accessible to, as an NFT. However, there was something lacking there. We thought, you know, this, this reflects the brand, but where's the flavor in this? And so we said, all right, NICAP, how would you guys actually approach this? Like, how, what should a coach bag look like in the metaverse? And this is what they came back with, which I think is beautiful. Absolutely. So we really wanted to take an approach to say, you know, what can be, you know, very immersive, but also very visually, you know, engaging. So, you know, a couple of weeks in the lab, just really kind of going through a few discover discovery sessions. This is kind of what we came up with. And again, like we were able to utilize this in multiple different ways, but to bring life and character to a product so that it's not just stagnant and boring.